two really annoying people. Like, I'm just over them right now. I just, I just need my space. I need to be in my element in front of my notepad, my computer. I'm just, I'm annoyed right now. Like, it's too late. Especially her. Elle est trop fancy, she knows what she's doing. Ça, <laughs> my OOTD. This is by Naomi Design. She makes amazing. She makes amazing things. Have the same haircut we don't look alike so y'all need to stop like mistaking her for me me for her yeah. we don't look alike we ain't got the same mother we ain't got the same father although our fathers are brothers yes. but we look like our fathers so maybe that's why we look alike. but our fathers don't really look alike they're they like really the ones who look, the, alike. look the least alike no papa yeah, clement looks like papa meda yeah, papa looks like papa jp really yeah so it's like papa True. pascal looks like papa meda too a little bit True. So I don't so know what y'all do. Technically, no. No. Oh. <laughs> I love you. I love you too. Bye. <laughs> Look at these two. I don't understand how two people can not get tired of each other. They FaceTime every day before they meet each other. And when they're with each other, they still have something to tell each other. How can two people have so much conversation? How? I'm going Les personnes qui aiment, bon, si on ne m'invite plus, bon, j'ai dit, bon, l'essentiel, j'ai fait ce que je devais faire. Alléluia. Alors, quand on me réinvite, c'est-à-dire que vous avez été content de la façon dont je vous ai choqué, ou car moi, je n'ai rien fait de mal ici. Donc, mais c'est une confiance que vous venez, je ne crois jamais ça à la légère. We just finished church, and we're heading out, and this one never likes to take my things from me. Thank you, Grace. You're so adorable. That's why people think you're my twin. And they don't even know my sister is actually my sister. I'm on my twin. My sister. Sister. His father used to beat him up, and his, his father was pimping his mom. You follow me, right? His mom had cancer, the mom died, and he became exactly what his father was, a pimp. Mm. But he hated his father. So when they asked me to do the piece, I had to really know the story well. I thought about it, but for some odd reason, I found so much of myself in the story. Inside, when the face you love the most is gone and is a ghost, but the man you don't want to see is the man you've become to be. The man you've become to be is the man you're forced to see. Reality. My ex, she gave me a prescription to the pill, told me she quit dancing for me, but that's how I pay my bills. 
Good grades don't keep the lights on, I haven't learned the skill, but you judge me. Tell me my life is wrong, but where were you all along? It's like a cycle, I'm on repeat, just singing the same old song. Man, I found no other way. My dad, he wants to take his place. I'm sorry, but my shed 10 years is just too late. Man, I'm sorry. I mean, I watched you kill my mother slow with every striking blow. Defenseless as a youth, this is how I was forced to grow. They tell me, forget all I know, let go and let some God. But my boys hit me up saying, let's go, it's just some fraud. I gotta play the hand I'm dealt with, can the dealer shuffle his cards? Man, I'm tired. Tired of the ifs and ands, searching through the desert sands. Not enjoying the joys of being a boy because I had to be a man. Confused and here I am, lost thinking. Where will I be? I'm just a cynic in a cycle. Yeah, that's me. Then he. Show no interest in where I've been. My thought-filled character, my vices, my sin. He. Show more interest in where I'm headed than where I could ever, ever begin. Though you think less of me, he loves me regardless. Yes, I, yes, I used to be spiritually retarded. He regarded me as qualified. My candidacy became valid. He taught me how to love, and now I have it. This serum of hope, faith, and love, letting go of hurt and lust. His name is Emmanuel. Yes, God with us. But y'all probably know him as G. Yes. So, where is it? One second. Follow me, right? I found myself, as soon as I walk outside, I see people, you know, people getting high, crackheads, prostitutes. I was really not in a good environment. And I find that a lot of us, what's going to dictate where we're going to go out in life is our environment, whether you like it or not. So, you are not even going to leave all the time. I'm 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 going to leave all the time. You feel me? So, at that time, the battery that was going on behind me was simply my ego. What do people think about me? What do I have? And what do I do? So, I started selling crack when I was 15 years old. People would knock on the, the, my bedroom window to buy drugs. I didn't care about my mom. I didn't care about my family. I was only caring about my self-esteem, about feeling myself hiding behind that image, picking up another like cover. And that's what I want to do in my life. I want to get young people to understand that no matter how broken you are, no matter how useless you feel, you can come. So that's kind of part of my story. I'll tell you guys a poem that I wrote on the 67. It's called Out of Space. <laughs> it's called Out of Space. And uh, I'll talk about the meaning after. All right, so. Noose around my ankle, the other end tied to a star. Wrist secure by the Saturn's rings, not too far from Mars. My soul's a black hole, but my ideas are bigger than the galaxy. I'm tired of friends, Milky Ways, and all of life's maladies. Actually, I find I'm weighing on the tragedy. I look all around, and all I see is blasphemy. Eclipses come rare, but what a sight to see. Three-fourths of body mass of water still shallow people breathe. After Orion's belt, life could be a big dipper. No stranger to the opposite sex, I've got seven sisters. Had a girl second to the sun like Venus. She made me feel like Pluto. Old and blue soft like a discarded Sudoku. To that unconstructive critic, you're like your anus. Your mouth should be a pinhole. My heart is tilted on the axes, no need to be for pseudo. Emotions define gravity, keep your negativity out of my orbit. Stargazers are light years behind and I'll just be adding until my corpus. I used to be intimidated, then I realized Jupiter was mostly gas. I no longer pay mind to it in, in Neptunes that fill my mind. I chose the past, past Andromeda where the naked eye couldn't reach. Though cratered and stricken, I learned to keep, keep meteors and asteroids in my outer space. Then suddenly, Earth became too small when I realized that I was great. And I let everybody know who didn't think the same, that when it came to their opinions, I was out of space. Nice. It's wonderful. It's a poem de viol par déception. En tant qu'un jeune homme, moi j'étais quelqu'un, à un moment donné dans ma vie, I, 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 I didn't realize that you could rape someone just by deceiving them. Mm. And this is something that took me some time to understand that when you tell someone I love you and you sleep with them and you don't mean it, that's rape. The same way, like if I come in with a uniform and I say that, yo, I'm, uh, I'm Belle, and I walk inside the door and you let Belle inside thinking that he's Belle, isn't that trespassing? Because you're under the pretense that he's somebody else. Yeah. And for a lot of women, when you say I love you, they will open their legs. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm trying to say? So that was me at a certain point, and it took time for me to understand that's rape. So when I had that conviction, I wanted to make sure that I got that message to other guys because I felt like, as a guy, 
the average guy is not gonna rape a woman. The average guy, a woman says, stop, you know, I'm good. You feel me, right? Mm -hmm. But if I make you understand that that's rape too, it kind of gets people to be more conscious about what they do and their actions. So that's rape. Let me ask you this question, like, what do you want to do if you could put word word on, what would it be? I want to inspire people. How? With what I have, with my... Through your gifts and talents, but which one? Out of all of them, which one? Uh, Donc, c'est des craintes reliées plus à notre ego personnel que vraiment sur la réussite du projet en soi. Non, mais si ça marchait pas, et si je Oui, mais, si, mais si, si, si ça marchait pas, c'est comment je vais paraître mm -hmm. le fait de l'avoir fait sortir. Mm -hmm. C'est pas vraiment si ça marche pas, parce que tu sais, à la fin, si ça marche pas, ok, le projet marche pas. Non, mais c'est plus l'image que je vais avoir. Si ça marche pas, j'ai fait tout, j'ai mis mon argent, j'ai mis, j'ai parlé aux gens, j'ai fait la publicité, tout Facebook, ça fait, puis ça marche pas. Mais c'est vrai parce que c'est it's a whole journey mm -hmm. and that's what I was speaking about mm -hmm. yesterday it's a c'est un processus c'est pas mm -hmm. du jour au lendemain que ça Exactement. se fait sortir de sa zone de confort mm -hmm. surtout si elle était large comme la mienne you have to walk you have to walk and it's a whole journey you have to go through steps you're gonna be broken again tu vas trouver des nouvelles zones de confort il faudra que tu sortes so je pense pas pour répondre un peu à ta question il n'y a pas de one remedy il n'y a pas de the one thing you can do mm -hmm. it's things you will have to do and it's gonna take time. Il y a personne que je connais qui est sorti de sa zone de confort genre OK, je sors de ma zone de confort téléportation, you know? You know, you know what I would say? Mm. I would say everything that they said is true, but I feel like it all goes down to one thing. Value. You know what I'm trying to say so come com you get in your comfort zone, you have it. But how you get out of your comfort zone is only one thing, value. And I'll explain. Le 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 the shows keep bouillon on air keep bouillon on tous. When that becomes more valuable than your pride, mm -hmm. when that becomes more valuable when people think about you, when it becomes more valuable than messing up, then you will make the choice to leave. It's like when you're home, you're comfortable, you're in your sheets, it's minus 30 degrees outside. But you're like, shit, if I don't go outside, I ain't gonna get paid. If I don't get paid, you know what I'm saying? I have a home. <laughs> I'll give you an example. It's minus 30 degrees. You're home. You're in your comfort zone. You're in your bed. You got your cell phone. You got Wi-Fi. But you hear the big doo doo outside. Then you got to move your car. What's more valuable? Getting your car towed or you stay in your comfort zone? Mm -hmm. So to be honest with you, you, you have to fail your way to success. Yes. There's no way you go from success to success. And sometimes the worst thing that can help, that, that could be worse, is being successful. You know how many people get successful and they stay at the same place because they had one success mm -hmm. at a certain place? So all you need to do is keep feeding that thing inside of you and it gets to a point where it's so hungry where it's like, you know what, I can care less what people think about me. Mm -hmm. I can care less what his mm -hmm. mom think about me. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do it anyway. And when you do it, some people going to hate, some people going to show love. Mm -hmm. There's two things that I feel like people do with that gift, you know what I'm trying to say? There's people that have an abortion and there's some people that have a miscarriage. You know who has an abortion? The people that feel like they're not the daddy. You know when you have something so great inside of you, you're like, nah, I can't do that. So you feel like you're not the daddy, so you let it go. And then sometimes you have a miscarriage because what's inside of you is so great, but you have so much anxiety, you have so much worry that you kill the baby inside of you because of worry mm -hmm. and things that are not even there. So I would tell you, yo, man, just continue to build up whatever, whatever that voice is. Keep feeding it to the point where that voice becomes louder than your fear, it becomes louder than everything else. Mm -hmm. And you and you get that attitude where you're like, you know what, I don't give an F about what nobody got to say, mm -hmm. I'm going to do it anyway. And if when I fail, not if you fail, because you will fail, when I fail, like uh, Les Brown was saying all the time, if you fall down, fall down on your back so you can at least see up. And if you can see up, you can get up. Mm -hmm. And at, at the end of the day, think about your audience, man. You know, like I told her, like I, I say it all the time, it's like, Whenever I don't find inspiration to write, when I think about young dudes like on the block, 
I get all the inspiration I need because it's not about nobody else but them. melting snow but you do see it right like look at their umbrellas it's crazy we're in Mount Royal right now on the plateau where all the French people come to live when they come to Montreal hi and now the rent are super expensive here because of them hey. I'm Yo, why are you vlogging everything, Cause I'm bro. vlogging everything, bro. God, God damn. damn. <laughs> Stop vlogging, bro. No, bro. Start living, dog. <laughs> <laughs> Boyfriend, that's not true. I ain't got no boyfriend. I'm not headed out. I'm gonna go wash my face and put my pajamas on <laughs> and start editing all these videos, all this footage. And later on, we're gonna film a few videos. We're gonna film the best friend tag, and I'm gonna film the sister tag with my sister. And okay, bye, 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 bye. -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye. So you better stop vlogging Look me, at though. his nose. I've always been obsessed with his nose. Like, there's no bones. Like, Bro, I'm going to sue you soon, bro. You can't, you can't just put my face out there like this, though.
oil. She's because, Canada oil. Because she got burned when she was little with hot oil, hot water, I mean. But you ain't gonna get burned. You don't put your hand in it. You okay? I did I told you to get Okay, she's gone. She's gonna end up falling on the floor. She's dangerous. Oh, man. 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 Oh,